Shabbos just ended and we're actually going to bat mitzvah soon that started an hour before Shabbos ended. I mentioned something about that before Shabbos and people were a little bit confused, but I want to be very clear. Not every Jewish person celebrates Shabbos. Not every Jewish person has a bar bat mitzvah, but I would say that a majority, at least that I know, who are religious, not religious, and everything in between, have some kind of bar bat mitzvah, even if it's not a big party. So the big bat mitzvah party that we're attending tonight actually started an hour before Shabbos ended, which is why I'm still home and not dressed for the bat mitzvah because literally Shabbos ended like five minutes ago. So now I'm going to go get dressed for the bat mitzvah and we're going to run to the city for it. We'll be very late, but at least we get to be there to celebrate with them. And yes, there are bar and bat mitzvahs that can happen on Shabbos, but not the big parties with all the dance music and all that kind of stuff like we did at Nora's bat mitzvah, which was on a Sunday, not on Shabbos, on Saturday. Any kind of party that we would have on Shabbos is more everybody just getting together and eating a nice meal, like in a synagogue or at somebody's home. And that's also, by the way, why I did my hair before Shabbos, because this isn't something that I could do on Shabbos and this would take a while. And there are a lot of religious Jews who don't do makeup on Shabbos, but that's actually something that I'm okay doing on Shabbos. Although this isn't like a full face of makeup, but I did a little bit before Shabbos was over. Well, it's probably not the most Shabbos stick or the most in the spirit of Shabbos thing to do.